A team of Mount Sinai surgeons performed the world's first donor tracheal transplant on January 13, 2021, making history and giving patients who have airway damage hope. The trachea connects the lungs with the upper airway or voice box. Damage to the trachea can lead to airway compromise, and if the defect is significant, it may be incompatible with life. Patients who undergo a tracheal transplant have extensive defects of the tracheal cartilage leading to a constriction of the airway as seen here. This makes it difficult to breathe and in some cases unable to breathe. The cilia that lines the trachea is critically important to move particulate matter including bacteria out of the lungs up through the upper airway. If you don't have this cilia as in a silastic tube or stent, the airway will clot or clog. The procedure was performed by making an incision, lifting up the skin and exposing the damaged trachea. You can see that the trachea receives vascular supply from a series of artery and veins that innervate both the thyroid gland, the trachea, and a portion of the esophagus. The trachea was removed with the damaged segment, including the cricoid cartilage. To reconstruct this, the transplant was performed by procuring a 9 centimeter segment of trachea from a donor. The trachea with the thyroid gland and its accompanying arteries and veins were placed into the recipient's neck. Using microsurgery, we reconnected the blood vessels including the arteries and the veins to restore blood flow back to the tracheal segment. This critical revascularization has led to the world's first tracheal transplant and will hopefully give a chance at life to hundreds if not thousands of patients around the world.